Welcome back guys. So I hope all of you will be fine. Uh, today we are going to solve question 2.33 and the statement of it is if a multiple choice test consists of five questions. Okay, so there are basically five questions in a test each with four possible answers of which only one is correct. Okay, so uh, in how many different ways can a student check off one answer to each question? Okay. Uh, so before solving the two parts of this question let me see that what is the scenario here so i will show you that what is the scenario here so i have five uh, questions so let me draw them in a way of this column box so we have what one two three and four five okay so these are what question one two question three question four and question five okay so these are different questions and each of these questions has four options to uh, pick a correct answer from okay so we have here four options for here for here for here and for here okay so uh, out of these four only one is correct so in how many different ways can a student check off one answer to each question so what would be it so if i call it n1 n2 n3 n4 and n5 so uh, here the total number of different ways of selecting the answers here would be what that would be the n1 multiplied by n2 multiplied by n3 multiplied by n4 and multiplied by n5 okay because with each option here the other options will be replicated or connected okay so therefore here it would be 4 multiplied by 4 multiplied by 4 multiplied by 4 and multiplied by 4 which will ultimately give me 4 raised to power 5 okay so that is basically the answer of my question or it can you can also calculate it that how much it is by using the calculator so this is what this is the answer of part a in part b uh, it is asking us that in how many ways can a student check off one answer to each question and get all the answers wrong okay so we know that from these four options only uh, one is correct okay so therefore the remaining three would be incorrect similarly here only one is correct while the remaining three will be incorrect similarly here similarly here and similarly here as well so uh, if he doesn't have to select the correct one how many options would he have so he would have again n1 n2 n3 n4 and n5 uh, total number of options to select from so therefore now he will instead of selecting any four he will select three from each of the question so therefore it would be three multiplied by three multiplied by three multiplied by three and multiplied by three which will be three raised to power five okay so this is what this is the answer of part b here okay so uh, i hope you have got the concept here that whatever it is uh, they will repli replicate it with the other option here as well so what does it mean so suppose if i have answered for first question a and for the other questions i have b b b b okay so uh, for this a all the b's are selected and similarly for this a the other replication can also be like d d d d d okay similarly here uh, c c c c c and also here a a a a so we can see that for each of the option here these have been replicating okay similarly after it what i will get suppose i will have here a a a a a and here b okay uh, what will happen here if a a a a a so here c 
and so on. So we can see here that this column has been replicating itself with all the other options. So therefore, the total number of options which will be here will be what? These would be what? These will be multiplied with the options with the other column. So here I will have the different number of options here, here and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, and from it I will get that the answer would be this one. Okay, these has to be replicated. Yeah. So that is the solution of this question, and uh, I. Um, hope that you have got the instant that why did i multiply them together and that is explained here by using this one similarly the other options here as well so i hope you have understood the concept if you again uh, got any question please ask me in the comment box i will see you with some more of this type of questions in our upcoming video so till then take care of yourself and i will see you soon